everyone, it's Julia and today I'm going to show you how to do an angel look for Halloween. Um, I'm using a lot of pink eyeshadow here, I've got individual feather plumes right here, some feather lashes, a lot of rhinestones, and yeah, that's what that looks like. I've got some rhinestones here on the side as well, and just some pink lips. So yeah, I think it looks really pretty for Halloween, very delicate, but very extravagant still. This is also going to be a video collaboration with Josh, aka Petrolude here on YouTube, and he's going to do the counterpart to this look. He's going to do a devil look. So I'm going to link his video at the end. Um, you can also find a link to it below, and you can check out his look if you're dressing up as an angel. Maybe someone else wants to dress up as a devil, and that would be like kind of cool, you know, costume for two people. So I really hope you enjoy watching. So the first thing I've done is applied the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk all around my eye and I've applied Urban Decay Primer Potion as a base before that. Now I'm going to take MAC White Pigment, this is a shimmery white product, and I'm going to just apply that all over my lid space area. And I'm just packing this on so that I get a really intense white payoff. And you can also just use a little bit of that on the tip of the brush and just apply it right here. Then I'm taking MAC Pink Pearl Pigment on a pencil brush like this and I'm just going to kind of do a very defined crease and just going to go along the natural shade of my crease here. Also just want to connect it down here. I'm going to take a brush like this and just kind of soften that out a little bit, just blend it in. Then I'm taking this pigment, this is by Naked Cosmetics and this is in the shade Cotton Candy. and. I'm going to apply this just above and I don't know how well this is going to show up on camera but it's like this really kind of cotton candy pink and it has like a lot of shimmer to it and it's going to just kind of blend that out and it's also going to act as a highlight up here. This is Sprite Fuchsia, this is a pro product and I'm just going to kind of define that crease a little bit. And that's just kind of going to intensify the pink. And I'm just going to take what's left on that brush and just kind of um, blend it down here so that it connects with the eyeshadow down here. So then I'm using this cosmetic glitter. It is sort of like a transparent with lots of different um, reflects to it. And I'm going to, with a slightly damp brush, just pat that over. Okay, so now I'm going to first do the cleanup, so I'm going to just use a cosmetic wipe and just get rid of any of that fallen glitter and stuff. I'm going to apply um, foundation and I'm also going to do my eyebrows and stuff like that. So I've applied a little bit of blush up here and up here, just like a pink blush. Um, now I'm going to do the fun stuff. So first I'm going to make a very, very thin line on the top of my lash. So I'm making it like really thin. And this is just going to disguise the lash band. It's like a very natural looking mascara, nothing too dramatic. Okay, so the lashes that I have chosen for this look are really, really perfect. They look like this. They have these little white feathers on the end, and um, these are really cute. I ordered these especially for this look, so I'm going to apply those and be right back. And now I'm using tiny individual strands of feather. So instead of gluing, like, basically I'm just getting a white feather like this. And this is, you can get this at a craft store. And it's, I mean, you could totally glue it on like that, but I think it just looks a little bit harsh. So what I did is I cut one of these feathers up about here, and then you're going to get lots of these kind of individual plumes, like this, okay? 
and I am just gluing these on one by one. And this is quite time consuming. Um, what I'm actually using for this is Ardell Lash Tight. This is kind of the glue that you would use for single lashes. So basically what I do is I pick up one of these plumes and you just dip it into this glue. What I just do is I just place it. Oops. Like that. So this definitely isn't the easiest process, but just use tweezers and you can use like an orange wood stick to just place it and just press it down onto the onto the eye and then that is going to help it to stick. So I'm going to add a little bit of um, rhinestones and colorful stones kind of just around the eye area and I'm just going to use again the Ardell Lash Tight Adhesive. So I've done some rhinestones here and on the side and that's just going to give like a really kind of strong sort of effect. I'm going to use a white coal pencil and just apply that into the waterline right here. Okay and for lipstick I'm going to use MAC Angel lipstick. And I'm going to top that with this lip gloss by Margaret Astor. It's called Pastel Pink. Okay, so I have put on my white wig and I've also added these little head decorations. Kind of looks like a crown or something. So I think that makes it look a little bit more angelic. Um, definitely check out Josh's video if you're dressing up as a demon. He's going to have sort of the counterpart to this look. And um, if you haven't already, also make sure to check out my contest that I'm holding right now. It's on until the end of October. And I'm giving away some really awesome prizes worth over $1,000 in value, including some um, really amazing brush sets by Hakuhodo. Um, so I will link that as well if you can if you want to check it out you can participate and thank you so so much for watching guys if you did enjoy I'd love it if you guys give me a thumbs about thumbs up or leave a comment below and I will see you very soon for my next Halloween tutorial see you later bye bye